time for Total Sports tonight. The University of Maine women's basketball team trying to clinch that spot in the NCAA tournament this afternoon. The only obstacle? Oh, the University of Hartford. The Hawks put up a fight to Kelly Douglas for three early on. Hartford led by one after the first quarter. And Paris Rosignal with another big tournament game for Maine. She had 12 points and is tied at the half. Blanca Milan sparked a third quarter run for the Black Bears. She had a game high 22 points. Then Dor Saar drains the three. Maine pulls away for the 74-65 win. They advance to the national tournament for the first time since 2004. This is an amazing, amazing team, an amazing moment. The crowd was incredible. It was just awesome. You scared us in the first half. Yeah, me too. <laughs> we couldn't really play any defense, but we fixed it in the second half. It's incredible. Um, we didn't care what our preseason ranking was. We know what we had on this team. And to finish like this in front of this crowd was unbelievable. I can't even explain this feeling. Well, now Maine finds out who and where they play coming up on Monday night. So watch for that right here. The Bowdoin College women advancing to the Elite Eight in the Division Three National Tournament. The Polar Bears beating Scranton 66-54. They now face Tufts on Saturday. In high school news, Teron Moss has been named Mr. Basketball for the state of Maine. He adds that to Gatorade Player of the Year, which he won on Thursday.